Hello everyone, I am Chase at Rocky Mountain ATVMC, giving you a closer look at the MX race chain from Primary Drive. All right, so today we're giving you a closer look at this MX race chain coming from Primary Drive. Now, Primary Drive is a brand that's been around for a long time. They make very high quality driving components. And what I love about them is they always have really good price points. Now, before we dive in and we talk about the features of their race chain, I just want to reiterate how important it is that no matter what bike you have, no matter what chain, it is crucial that you keep up on your chain maintenance. You want to make sure you're keeping it clean, keeping it lubricated. You want to have the right amount of slack in your chain. We even have tools that we sell that help you keep the right amount of slack. And you also want to be replacing it as often as needed. If you're not quite sure maybe how much slack you need to have or how often you should be replacing your chain, you can look at your service manual. If you've never replaced the chain before, we have a great how-to video that shows you step-by-step -step how to do that. So just remember, keep up on your chain maintenance. But with this race chain for primary drive, right off the bat, a couple features I want to point out is one, I love the gold plating on here. I think they look awesome, give a really cool look to your bike. And the other feature I really like, super high quality, 8,900 pound tensile strength, which gives it one of the highest tensile strength ratings of any MX race chain that we do sell. Now, a lot of riders will ask the question, what's the difference between a standard race chain and say an O-ring or X-ring chain? And how would I know which one to choose or which one's gonna be best for me? We'll help answer that question. So an O-ring or an X-ring chain actually have seals in the links that help keep lubrication in. They're very popular for off-road, desert riders, trail riders, because they do require a little less maintenance because those seals keep that lubrication in, and they also do tend to last a little bit longer. But what's nice about a race chain, and this is gonna be the top choice for most of your pro riders out there, is because they don't have those seals in there, they're gonna be thinner, which makes them lighter, and they also have less drag, which takes away less horsepower than your O-ring or X-ring chains will. And that's why, like I said, they're gonna be the more popular choice for your off-road racers. Now, the last little thing I do wanna highlight that I like about a race chain is that because you don't have those seals in there, it's not gonna be as wide. Now, for some smaller bikes and even some bigger bikes, when you run an O-ring or an X-ring chain or try to, you run into fitment issues. And what'll happen is those chains, because they're wider, will actually rub on your cases around that counter shaft sprocket. So with a race chain, you don't have to worry about that. Now look, this is not the least expensive race chain that we offer at Rocky Mountain, but you have to remember that not all chains are created equal. And with this chain, for the amount of quality that you're getting here, it still comes in at a very good price point. Now a couple other things we wanna mention before we let you go, it does come included with a master link. And also, as you can see on the table, this chain, it does come lubricated. So when you get yours, all you gotta do is just take it out of the package and stop, you're gonna be ready to go riding. Now with that, when it comes to fitment, you gotta remember every bike has a stock size chain length. If you're not quite sure what yours is, you can use your manual to find out, or if you use our parts finder on our homepage, enter the make, the model, and the year of your bike, it will actually say right there underneath what your stock size chain length is, and that will help you out. But if you do have some modifications to your gearing, maybe you've added or taken away teeth, you need a shorter or longer chain, well, it's very simple. When you're selecting your chain, you can just select a shorter or longer length than what comes stock, and you're gonna be good to go. And there it is. That is the MX race chain coming from Primary Drive. Again, super high quality chain, great price point. It's gonna be a great replacement chain for just about any rider out there. If you guys have any other questions about this chain, you can leave your comments below, give us a call or chat live online. We will get those answered. And to pick yours up, it's real simple. Just click on the link at the end of this video. Make sure you guys, when you're at Rocky Mountain, look at all the other great Primary Drive components, super high quality, great price points. If you guys like this product spotlight, get subscribed to our YouTube channel. That's gonna keep you up to date and in the loop in the latest gear guides product reviews, and how-to videos that we are constantly rolling out. I am Chase. We'll see you on the trails.